Welcome to another session and in this session we're going to be learning Make it of the rotate button a lot, okay. This is H. This is gonna rotate it. It's A. Nice. And bring in the P. Bring in P. Over. So make sure. They are properly aligned. If not, it's not going to come out nice at all. So the second P. Bring it here. Then Y. 
comes next this is y now we have happy so now let's do for birthday takes a little bit clustered let's start with this okay this is b That's here. This is B. Then we're bringing I over. Just I. Just have to make sure that they are properly, they are properly aligned. This is I. Well, one has to be very careful. And then not to make a mistake. This might look stressful, but trust me, when you're done, it's going to look really beautiful and even more accurate than the automatic method of carving text. This is T. I'm bending T a bit. Then I'm bringing H. Taking this A back. Sorry. Meaning H, H, just H. Okay, coming H a bit. And this D, D comes next. I hope you're seeing how I'm actually taking my time to do this, so you get everything this is a i'm just gonna turn a a bit like this okay and then y comes next this is y so as you can see oh, it has to be properly aligned Now this is happy birthday, so we're just going to add the name of the celebrant, which is Joanne. Today, then this O. Ready have A here. Duplicating this, changing it to N. J. J. And it's O. Now this looks beautiful if you ask me. So join. Okay, or maybe I'm just gonna shift it a bit. J. It's O. Then. We have uh, A over here. And then N comes to stay here. Now this looks perfect. So now we want to make, I want to change the color to white white looks
think white is going to make it up. So this is actually how you manually curve text with Canva. But like I said earlier, there are no automatic way to curve text with Canva. So this is it. This is it. And it's looking good. So let's just add a, a background to make it pop more flower canva has a lot of image in the gallery now see nice and i'm just going to make it look more beautiful by adding a rose flower in the middle something here it bring it here duplicate it again and bring it here to the middle to the middle okay it's looking beautiful this is how you curve text with canva I'm going to want you to do something similar. So thank you and watch out for our next class. God bless you.